Hi guys, Rose Tan here, inspiring you to live the lifestyle that you want. I would love to talk to you about this letter that I actually wrote to myself at a wonderful event, another Tony Robbins event. Not that I'm affiliated or well, actually I, I am kind of affiliated, <laughs> but yeah, I attended uh, one of his amazing um, events, Date with Destiny back in December 2018 and boy was that a ride of a lifetime um, I would love to share what I actually written out a letter to myself which is seven months from then should I read it out <laughs> okay um, right. so this is to myself dated on the 11th of December 2018 babes my greatness my royalty line queen I know how committed and loyal you are to yourself. The amount of dedication, determination, humble and love, gratitude you are to yourself. Because you tell yourself how magnificent you are for being so courageously powerful and inspiring and genuinely so beautiful by leading yourself to be and bear yourself at such vulnerability and strength. Here, my darling, you have set such high standards and guided divine journey to lead by example with such grace and humbleness to share, shine your sunshine and huge heart will lead to many, many amazing opportunities because your beautiful soul and potential to reshape the world with every step you make. Such success will appear but it has already my love you are grace you are the successes that is the role model Thomas and Theodore will be there for you every step of your successes and your new love twin flame or soulmate will challenge you to be the best ever version of yourself PS you have so much love and sunshine in your heart and soul. It won't be long before you are in union with this gorgeous, incredible, sexy, powerful, masculine man into your life where he will love and cherish every present moment because you deserve every happiness and fulfillment, intimacy, passion and romance than you ever thought possible and dreamed of. Babes, something amazing and magical is happening in this new ultimate destiny of life of yours because it is your birthright miss royalty lion queen and i asked myself a question at the, towards the end how do i love myself even more so every day with the amount of love and gratitude and grace sign rose xxx -X -X. um reason why i wanted to read out that letter is a very delicate topic because that was a time when I was going through a lot of um, I can say frustration confusion and just wanted clarity and I wanted to have that certainty and the belief and self-confidence within myself whatever I set my mind out to achieve then I can achieve it so hmm um, I hope that inspires you to script journaling um, write yourself a letter and then read it when you feel you need a little pep me talk yeah it just it's, it's it's like a coach of your own self reminding you of how powerful and how courageous you are and how beautiful and how you know so much love gift and talents that you have to showcase to the world and what you can do with them that can empower and inspire others to do the exact same thing uh, moving on I wanting to share you my vision board now most of us have like a huge piece of paper where we you know glue in on you know um, cut out pictures from magazines or we print it out from the Google you know um, what we actually wanting to manifest into our life now 
in speaking of term wise, term wise, we don't know when that can actually take place and become into fruition. But mark my words, it will come to you at the most unexpected, needed most times. <laughs> the universe has its magical, mysterious ways into bringing things into your life when, when it's most mostly needed. And you thought you actually needed a week in advance, or 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 such. But no, it actually comes to you at the most unexpected way where you just feel like oh, I need it just now. It's like oh, the angels have my back. The universe and God has my back. They will always look after you. Um, it, it also depends on how hard you manifest, on how hard you do your other part of your work to really manifest that and put that out into the universe and let them hear you and how hunger and how hungry and determined you are with your manifestation and dream and goals, okay? So moving on, my vision board here, first is a provincial home. So um, I don't know why I actually mentioned it's in Cheltenham. I don't know, it's the first thing that I thought when it comes to dreaming about a brand new home. Okay, um, I will take a, a snapshot of it and post it to you um, towards the end of this video um, so here is my dream kitchen so everything's like a neutral you know um, Grecian kind of uh, style flavor you know I, I like to keep things neutral because it just goes with everything it's warm it's inviting it's cozy and that's me in my personality wise you know I like a nice fireplace I like a nice cozy comfortable couch with plenty of fluffy cushions and throws um, that's my dream, um, I don't know, you can call it like a towards the backyard door living area and here's my dining area there and this is my dream design stairway um, here you will see that's an Emirates airplane uh, those Emirates airplane where it's like I think it's double decker it has a it has a bar and it has its own suite, so you can actually sleep. You actually have your own room, get your own little privacy. Um, yeah, so that's a bar there. This is my dream New York City penthouse apartment. Oh my god! I, don't, I have this on my um, uh, screensaver on on my laptop um, screen, and I just love the look of it, the design is just mm, it just so it, it it just feels like it's already mine it's 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 weird right but if you keep on manifest manifesting that and if you keep on dreaming about that and it's the first thing or you know it, it just pops up to your mind your sub, your subconscious mind just reminds you you know keep your eye on the prize focus on it you will get it one day we don't know when but it depends on how hard you manifest you know and really to really let go surrender and trust the universe for it to do its half of the job okay um this is my dream car uh so most of you would actually know that i have manifested a dream car a white range rover evoke um and then here is Santorini yeah Santorini oh my god it's my um one of my huge bucket lists that I wanting to visit you know um because I don't know I, I, I just feel like I have a little bit of wog in me <laughs> um I would like to call myself a banana you know yellow from the outside and white and mushy from the inside <laughs> <laughs> okay um so yeah uh and also my na my name rose is originated from from the uh greece from yeah greek um also yeah there's like a little bit of affirmations there where it says i am and then i can put in i can plug in whatever it is like i am powerful now i am successful now so when you say the two powerful words, I am, it just really anchors. You say it with conviction and you just feel like, yeah, I got this shit. It's mine. <laughs> okay. Um, here I have, uh, it says, watch your thoughts. 
they become words. Watch your words, they become your actions. Watch your actions, they become habits. Watch your habits, they become character. Watch your character, it becomes your destiny. I love that. It is. It cannot be put in any better way. It just speaks so loudly and so clearly that a lot of us can make sense of it and relate back to us, right guys? Uh, yeah, that's what I just wanted to share, my vision board and my letter that just received a couple of days in the mail from Florida and West Palms Beach in December when I last visited. Um, yeah, I hope this, ins this video inspires you as it has inspired me you know, to keep going, you know, to say that I am committed to my dream and goal and vision. Um, okay, if I have missed out anything, I will leave it down in the description box. Up until next time, guys, I love you. Mwah.